What's up guys? My name is Nick and today we're talking about the image of God. But first, I gotta show you this video my sister sent me the other day of my dog trying to catch a frisbee. Just like this picture reflects my dog's personality in real life, we as humans are created in the image of God to reflect his character in our lives. Whoa. Genesis 127 says this, So God created human beings in his own image. In the image of God, he created them. Male and female, he created them. That means that you are created in the image of God. Being created in the image of God means that we get to reflect God's character to the world around us. That's great! But what happens when I mess up? As humans, we're all going to mess up. We're all gonna sin. When we sin, it distorts the image of God that we reflect. But God sent his one and only son, Jesus, so that even when we sin and mess up, we still have a path back to God through him so that we once again can reflect his image to the rest of the world. Yeah! Yeah! So how do we find out about God's character so we can reflect it to the world? The Bible. The Bible tells us all about the image of God and how we can reflect it to the world around us. It tells us that God is loving, kind, generous, patient, slow to anger, forgiving, and so much more. So here's my challenge to you. Reflect God's image today and every day by always being kind to other people. Be generous with what you have. Be patient with your parents, your teachers, your friends, and always be ready to forgive other people. When you do these things, the world around you will see God's image being reflected through your life, and you will show that you are created in the image of God.